Hi, Carla, I see your uh, superheroes and I raise you kittens. They are the cutest little kittens. In fact, they have quite the Instagram following. <laughs> and Scott knows just how to get them to look at the camera. <laughs> Okay, so I want to introduce Sarah. We know Ashley with the Humane Society. Mm -hmm. And Sarah's been fostering these little guys. In fact, uh, Sarah's kind of a media maven as well because you made an Instagram page for these, or a hashtag, I guess, for these little guys. Taken off, man. Tell me their names and the Instagram so we can check it out. Yeah, so this is uh, Mr. Gray mm -hmm. and this is Jack. We have followed their foster story. I'm so proud to be their foster mom. And I just really wanted to document their foster story. And kind of each day we would take a photo and post it of, you know, their first, you know, bottle feedings and transition oh. to different foods and my children feeding them. What's and the hashtag? Hashtag Jack and um, Mr. Gray. Jack and Mr. Gray. Mm -hmm. They are the cutest kittens I have yeah. ever seen. And they're looking for a home. How are, what's their temperament? They are. So uh, Mr. J uh, Jack over here, he is super Jack. snuggly. He's uh -huh. just so sweet and lovable. And Mr. Gray loves to play. He loves to um, chase his toys and just, he's so full of energy. And he goes right to my funny eyebrow. Yeah. You know how you always have one eyebrow that doesn't work as well as the other? This cat went right for it and said, I know that one's weird. I know too, but look at that face. I'm sorry, that face is just the cutest thing I've ever... <laughs> look at Scott. Sell yourself, baby. So these two, do you want them to go together? Yes. Okay. They are a bonded pair. Okay. They're yeah, so they'll cute. be available yeah. today at our Sunny Slope campus at noon. If anyone's interested in coming down and meeting them at the Arizona Humane Society, they are a... Uh, a buddy system pair, so they're open for a home. Then we'll welcome both of them. And we have lots and lots of kitties this time. You before. have 200 animals, or rather you have a need for 200 foster parents right now. So there is an online class that you can take to get certified, ready to go. Tell me about that. Yeah, it's really easy. You go to azhumane.org forward slash foster. We have an online orientation that will tell you everything you need to know about how to be a foster parent. The Arizona Humane Society provides all the supplies that you need, all the care and support that you'll need to raise them. Um, a kitty or a puppy, we have dogs and cats that have injuries that need just a few weeks to heal up from that. And then once they're ready to go out for adoption, then um, you can bring them back to the shelter and find them forever home. So it's great for people who can't commit long term yeah. to a pet, but you still want to have you know the kids or the family involved in having animals around the house. It's great for that. They're cute. Look at those faces. <laughs> so find that hashtag and we'll check out these beautiful pets. We'll be right back, Arizona.